Tonight, there are multiple congressional investigations into President Trump's removal of inspectors general. Those are the officials charged with investigating corruption in government agencies. It comes as Secretary of State Mike Pompeo is firing back at his critics. CBS's Nancy Cordes reports. A defiant Secretary of State defended the firing of his agency's inspector general, Steve Linick. We should have done it some time ago. Secretary Pompeo would not say why he wanted Linick out. I can't give you specificity. And he downplayed reports that Linick had been investigating him. I've seen the various stories that like, someone was walking my dog to sell arms to my dry cleaner. I mean, I mean, it's all just crazy. CBS News has confirmed Linick had been investigating a controversial arms sale to Saudi Arabia and the alleged use of a State Department aide to run personal errands for Pompeo and his wife. But I'd rather have him on the phone with some world leader than have him wash dishes because maybe his wife isn't there or his kids are there, you know. President Trump has fired or replaced five independent watchdogs, including Linick, in the past six weeks. What this president is doing is undermining our democracy. A trio of top Democrats are now investigating why the acting inspector general at the Transportation Department was just replaced. They say he had been probing whether Secretary Elaine Chao steered grants to projects in Kentucky, the state her husband, Mitch McConnell, represents. Leader McConnell has long denied that his state got any special treatment. His Republican colleague Chuck Grassley told reporters today that he's irritated that he has still gotten no explanation for these firings. Nora? Nancy Cordes on Capitol Hill tonight. Thank you.